Greetings from the International Space Station. I am Astronaut Sultan Niyadi and today's question is, does microgravity affect your cardiovascular and respiratory systems? Weightlessness in space can affect astronauts' health in the long term. When astronauts arrive to the ISS, blood tends to accumulate in the upper part of their bodies, resulting in swelling in their faces, and eventually it may affect the breathing and the heart functions that might lead to a decrease in the overall fitness. We think of breathing as the inhaling of oxygen and the exhaling of carbon dioxide, but it also impacts your blood pressure and the heart rate. You can perform a simple experiment on yourself to understand this better. Place your fingers on your wrist and now take a deep breath. And slowly exhale. Did you notice that your pulse went up and down while you're breathing? This is due to the important nervous system reflex. And today I'll be talking about the experiment Cardio Breath, which focuses on these reflexes. This experiment in collaboration with the Canadian Space Agency, Simon Fraser University, and the University of North Dakota. We use the Biomonitor shirt and its headband to monitor our heart rate, blood pressure, blood oxygen level, and the electrocardiography, also known as ECG. In space, our measurements are taken while floating and while exercising on the CVS ergometer. This will allow researchers to see how body changes between the rest and the exercise. The measurements taken on the ISS will be then compared to the ones taken on Earth. Furthermore, results from cardio breath will aid the development of recovery protocols for astronauts and may also improve the health of elderly patients worldwide. Once again, thank you for joining me.